Hi, it's Kelly here, and I would like to answer the question for you in the topic of electroculture. It's probably the most burning question that people have about it, and that is, which way should your, your wire be twisted? Should it be counterclockwise or should it be clockwise in the northern hemisphere, southern hemisphere, and which, in which direction should it be planted into the ground? Well, the answer, surprisingly, is both directions simultaneously. And how do you do that? It's really, really simple. You take your length of copper wire, it might be two feet or it could be ten feet, whatever you're going to be using, and you stick, you, you fold it in half. And then you take the, the bend part of it and stick it into a power drill. And then you've got the loose end on the other end, and on that end you're going to hold it with the pliers or something like that. And then you turn it on, the power drill, and it will braid your copper wire so that it's going in both directions at the same time. So let me give you an illustration of it, and I'll explain to you why that's so fantastic. As you can see here, this is a globe. It has like four or five copper uh, rings here that make a globe. Then it has this big fat one here that's also been treated the same way. So when you braid it, you now have the wire in both a clockwise and counterclockwise direction. This has been used in coaxial cables to make the cable more potent. It transmits more energy going through it. Um, you see, if you have a cable or, or a copper wire and it's straight or even coiled, but not braided, the energy is all flowing in one direction from one end and out the other. All right, So you basically only end up with one frequency being generated. But when you have it braided like this, the electrons have a tendency to want to jump off and then come back. And so then you, each one of them is doing that all the time. You know? And so you're creating it just a, count, a near countless number of frequencies coming off of it. And they are irregularly shaped, which is exactly what you want. That's what the sun provides, are irregularly shaped frequencies. They're called fractal frequencies because they're you know, different heights and different, different lengths. And so for people or pets or plants, it is able to get the frequencies that resonate with it well, and then the other frequencies just pass on through without any issue because they're not a repeating beep, 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 like, a, like an alarm clock. They're just, you know, flowing, flowing through you. So from now on, hopefully this, this ends the question and, and also ends the question, does it need, do you need to plant the things on the north side or the south side? It does not matter when you do this because you've got the energy coming in both directions. Works perfectly and it's more potent, way, way more potent. Now, if you think this is phenomenal, uh, wait till you find out how you can take your, your electroculture and increase the power of it by, I'm gonna say 100 times because it's a number that we can relate to, although the number's actually in the gazillions. All right and do it in one minute and you can have it running in your house because it goes through mountains, walls, and windows. I don't charge for this. The I provide the information freely. You just buy the supplies that you need to do it and you're off and running in one minute. So instead of spending hours and hours and hours of coiling copper wires and cutting them and planting them and or trying to build a tower to reach, you know, so you can reach 100 or 200 feet radius this will take care of your entire garden. It will take care of your entire farm. It will take care of the 10 farms around the farm. And uh, that's in my most recent video prior to this one. So if you subscribe, you can find it easily. And you'll be notified of new videos I make if you like this one. And uh, also like the video, and that will enable more and more people to find out about this. And we will have a worldwide Garden of Eden by doing this. By the way, there's more information about this in my book. Is there a question that heals instantly? I've written a couple chapters on it in there uh, for you. And I'm also the author of this book, The Doctor Cures Cancer. This is the book in Russian. 
I was the co-founder of Science Magic, and I was the person who upgraded the fidget spinner, turned it into a whirling bliss machine. Um, that's enough about me. So go ahead and subscribe and like and watch my other videos so you can do this a hundred times stronger and do it in one minute and you'll be so tickled. But in the meantime, you can braid your wires and, uh, and have at it. So it's just one continuous wire. You don't cut it in half. You just bend it and stick it in the uh, power drill and hold the other end or have someone else hold it or whatever and let it braid. So it comes out like this. Well, you take care. Thank you and God bless.